So challenges for our clients and for the work that we do within the company relate to technology. So it's very formative in terms of the building blocks for the wearable technologies that we create, but also the design of the service and how that interacts with existing services, for example, in the NHS, which is a very traditional and established world, and then how that relates to medical device and medical advice that those uh, wearable technologies will end up giving to people. I think the last five years we've seen things change from being very consumer-led and that in combination with very traditional medical devices, they're at either end of a spectrum. Um, consumer devices are informing medical devices from a user experience point of view and likewise medical devices are really informing the design of new, uh, more uh, consumer facing devices that can allow people to look after their health in a sort of pre predictive or preventative way. So it's a kind of mix between those things and also at the same time technology is always shrinking so we're able to look at um, form factors that are much more discreet that are maybe in embedded into clothing or into shoes or glasses or hats or all sorts of other form factors and they don't get in the way, they don't have to make a big statement. So the technology becomes useful when it's useful and then it becomes discreet uh, and not part of the conversation when it's, when it's not.